Netball is such an all-around sport. You need to be strong, you need to be fast, you need to be nimble, you need to be able to jump, you need to have accuracy, you need to have every single thing that you can possibly have in a sport, you need to have it within netball. Netball has so many different aspects to it, which is why it's an amazing sport. So, and it makes us women so much stronger as athletes and as people as well, because we've got to overcome these people who are saying that netball is not it's a sport, it's a, it's a nothing sport, like, oh, men don't play it, like, as much, so it mustn't be a great sport. Like, we can just, like, just go, go away with that opinion because we know we train super hard, we know we're powerful, we know we're fast, we know we're strong, like, it is the best sport to be involved in. I know the people in England will talk about netball in a way that, oh, it's a girly sport, it's, um, oh, it's just, super flamboyant and like it just like you're wearing dresses and like all, all this and it's just it is just not that kind of sport like the girls in the gym we are lifting super super heavy and um, they're super quick we train like incredibly hard because netball is such an all-around sport you need to be strong you need to be fast you need to be nimble you need to be able to jump we need to have accuracy you need to have every single thing that you can possibly have in a sport you need to have it within netball. I, I, I hate it as well when people say, oh, they're just being emotional on court. We're not being emotional at all. We are being fierce. We're trying to do everything that we can for our team and everything for ourselves and everyone who has helped us get to this journey on that court in that moment. And it's not us being emotional, it's us showing passion for the game. All the time we see the men going up to the umpires and arguing with, with the referees, sorry, and trying to, or, fight about them not getting a yellow card or a red card. I'm sure that'll happen in AFL. I haven't actually watched an AFL game, so I wouldn't know. Um, um, that happens all the time. It happens like every day. As soon as, say, if me, if I would say, what was that? What was that call? Straight away on Twitter, on anything, people would be on there straight away saying, did you see El Cardwell today? That is unacceptable. I'm like, I'm, it, it's me showing passion. I'm trying to do anything that I can for um, the women around me and trying to like get, gain us the ball, trying to maybe have a conversation with the umpire in that moment, saying, what, what are you seeing so I can maybe change what I'm doing in my game? And trying to get one over my teammate at the end of the day. We want to win. Um, we've worked super hard for this moment and yeah, we won the win at the end of the day. The whole, like, it, I'm here if you need, like, yes, we are, we are people, we are here for our teammates. Uh, if any of the team, my teammates have an issue or anything, I am straight away there for them. But on the netball court, like yes, we're there for each other because we've been training with each other for months and months and months. But at the end of the day, that goes out the window. We are doing anything we can for the win. It's not being friendly against the opposition. Like yes, I will shake their hand at the end of the game because that's the game ended. But anything that goes on the court, goes on that court. And it's a sport at the end of the day and we are rivals. We are like the peak of our career. And we are just, yeah, we've trained super hard for this moment. So why am I gonna say, oh, sorry for doing, like knocking you once. Like that's, that's not the game. The, the game's moved on from that. The game's moved on from that girly girl sport. It's now being about the strongest you can be in the, the, yeah, the most powerful you can be on that court and who can get over, over the rivals. So yeah, it's definitely gone past that.